All right, guys. Check it out. It's the uh, it's the not so famous Morgan here, back in Ark Scorched Earth. Um, and I know last episode, I said this episode we were probably gonna team up with Mantis, but but that is not the case because I forgot that you need um, bug repellent in order to tame up mantises and um nightwing can you can confirm we do not have the necessary things to make bug repellent just yet so that is why off camera i went and i did this i went and i tamed up a dung beetle made a little dung beetle cage just on the side of our house right there so we can come in grab fertilizer do the whole fertilizer thing <clears throat> and i built this right over here so uh it's quite a ways away down but i built i started up a garden it's a tiny garden just has citronol and rock carrots in it and uh, so far it is not ready yet but like i got the the pipes and stuff like that going so these are all hydrated and if you look inside here we've almost got a full thing of fertilizer in there so we will be able to get Manti soon, if not, not this episode, but next episode. Um, and I also got this, so check this out. So I went and I found a, another death worm. Surprisingly enough, these guys are hard to come by, um, on my server anyways. But, um, yeah, I got two now, so we have a couple. And with the, with the rates turned up and stuff like that on my, my end, it should be plenty enough to, um, to get uh, to get a mantis tamed up so we'll probably find i know there's a couple hundreds running around close by uh the base here so that's good and also i forgot that i have the uh the tech rex skin so i threw it on the irex and i mean, we don't even have to change the name because the name still makes sense it's like a robot t-rex like uh yeah like a robot t-rex so with that um and you guys have seen, if you guys have uh, clicked on the episode, you'll have seen the title, which is we are going to go on the hunt for a waiver. Um, and I don't know, we might, we might hatch it up too. That's kind of, if you're wondering, that's what this is. This is the, uh, the ring of hatching for the waiver and egg. Um, I think I still need, I put up a couple more torches and they don't have wood in them, so I'll have to, um... I'll have to get those and put the wood in that. Um, nothing Sandshrew can't fix because he is a machine when it comes to um, collecting up wood and stuff. So, <clears throat> um, and in case you're wondering, I have I have tested this. So, just so you guys know, um, there is an egg right here. So, even if uh, even if I fail at this run, we do have a backup egg that we can hatch. Um, so, what we're gonna do here, so, I'll, um, uh, quickly, I'll just show you on the map. So, we are in the south here, so what we need to do is you need to go all the way to the right side of the map, right at around 60 and 15-ish, is, um, the Dragon Trench. It's right, it's right by the, uh, Red Relic or the red rune pillar thing. And the the scar, or the trench, the wavering trench, goes all the way over to the uh, blue pillar. So there's like a whole line that we can you can fly down and into and uh, check for waver nests. And every time there's a waver nest, there is a guaranteed an egg from, uh, from my knowledge anyways. Um, but I'll be able to show you what I what I mean once we once we get there, um, and once we get there, I will bring you guys back. All right, guys, uh, we're here, and as you can see right down here, through goddamn RG fur. So right here, you can kind of see fluff. Um, you can see the back of my RG head. Um, I might just be easier to fly over here. So. Right here is said trench that we were that we are going to be flying in, and um, right there is the red pillar. 
and right over there is the blue pillar. So it starts like kind of right over here by this big mountain here. But um, you'll know when you see these here, these ruins. It's like a big gladiator arena over here. Um, so if you find that, that's kind of that's right in the right in the mix of where we where we want to be here. Um, I'll show you exactly on the map where I am. So right right where I kind of like told you was was right over here. So uh, <clears throat> but yeah, so we are. I'm just gonna find kind of an edge here. And we gotta watch out for waverns. As you can see, there's one down there. Um, so we don't really want to... Ah, oh, crap, there's a storm coming. So we don't wanna fight any of these things. We just wanna fly in, and you wanna check these little caves here. Oh, there's a wavern right there. And as you can see, there's an egg right, right where that one's flying, so... Um, we might try and lure that one out and go in and get that egg. Um, no matter what level the egg is, um, we're going to take it anyways and we're going to hatch it. So I'm going to fly in and I'm going to try and get this Weaver's attention. I didn't get it. Okay. Um, I'm just worried that that's a uh, lightning wyvern. I think it is. Crap, I didn't see what it was. All right, there we go, he's falling. Good, 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 good. All right, so we're gonna lead this guy away. Just for a little while. The, uh, the poison wyverns are the easiest to get away. Um, their projectiles don't really fly straight they kind of uh, fall down like they have a drop off that's pretty pretty easy to dodge so um if you're ever trying to like um because i know we need we're gonna need wyvern milk and the only way to do that is to either kill alphas or to knock out female wyverns and um i'm not 100 percent sure i can knock out a wyvern by myself So, uh, I think we might try and take the Irex and kill that Alpha Wyvern that's right by our base. Um, so if that doesn't work, then I'm not 100% sure what we're going to do. Like, I really don't want to lose the... Oh, crap. Sandstorm. Oh, crap. Sandstorm. Oh, crap. We might die here. We might die here. Oh boy, oh boy, this is really scary. He's doing a lot of damage to us. I don't know, I don't know if we're gonna be able to do this. Come on, come on. Yes, we got him. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, okay. We need to we need to land right now. We need to land right now. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna land us and um, I'll bring you guys back once we are out of this hellish sandstorm. Okay? All right, guys. So I'm back. Uh, the sandstorm's over. I'm just making my way back over towards the um, towards the trench here. Um, I'm gonna make a stop for uh, stamina right away here, just so I don't. Uh, Boy, our little buddy's not looking too good. Um, I was trying to get stuff made up for a uh, for a tent here, and um, got attacked a little bit, but um, Nightwing was able to help us out. Um, but um, yeah, this uh, pretty much just worked through the sandstorm and ended up um, not really needing the tent at all. Um, but anyways, we got. We have a tent for the next time that uh, we get attacked by a sandstorm. That might
be his coloring, which is very misleading. Um, but as you can see, we're back here at the trench, and um, I don't see... Oh, there's another. Is that... Oh boy. So there's a couple. There are a lot more in here now. Um, there's that egg that we want right there. Uh, the wing. I wing near in my wing. So there is a fire wavering right there. Um, that is a poison. That looks like another poison. Shit. Uh, my god. Okay, we're just gonna move down the line here and hope. Hope we can find a, uh, a nest that doesn't have any waverns close by it. So I'd very much like to catch, get an egg with you guys here. Crap, we're getting followed. Yep, he is following us. Fudge, okay. Um, I'm gonna deal with this and hopefully, hopefully, there we go, he turned away. Okay. I was gonna leave, but... What level is that thing? It's too far away, I can't even tell. Alright guys. I'm gonna make a break for it. Looks like a poison egg. Level 20. Perfect. Uh, come on, get on. Now all the wyverns are gonna aggro to us that are in the area. So we just gotta hightail it out of here. So there's a fire wyvern. There should be way more coming right away too, but um, it's frightening. That is a big wavering. Alright. Head over this way. These guys are going to follow us for a long, long time, too. Like, it's going to be crazy. When I took that one egg um, the other day, uh, they followed me halfway across the map before they gave up. Um, and they got real close to me, so it's pretty terrifying. Um... Yeah, so we're just gonna we're just gonna boogie away, and um, with our our 190 movement speed, it shouldn't take too long for them to uh, lose interest in us. Uh, I'm just worried about getting blindsided by those other two that uh, flew up the mountain. If you know what I mean? Um, oh look, he's taking off. Perfect. All right, so I'm just gonna t uh, fly this back to base, and I'll bring you guys back once I'm at base. All right, guys. So, um, I'm a little disappointed, but um, the footage screwed up, and um, the Alpha Wavern battle didn't get uh, captured. Um, so that really sucks. But I got uh, I got these cool uh, Wavern glove skins from the Alpha Wavern. They look like this. They're they're pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Um, oh, I'm gonna pick up our little buddy. I did get, I got a preserving bin, uh, built up. I was gonna use it to put the milk in, uh, but the milk, uh, the spoilage timer doesn't matter, even if you do put preserving salts in the refrigerator, so, uh, I put them on the Raptor. So, the Raptor is holding our Wavern milk, so I got a couple hours in order to do this, but... Um, so, 
we have the uh, green wyvern egg and we have the red wyvern egg. So we're gonna hatch the green one first, just because I've never I've never d done the egg hatch thing before, so I'm kind of new to it. Um, I do have the timers turned up on that, so just to be safe, uh, I'm going to make sure that all of these have wood in them. I think it's just those. Whoops. Yeah, those three. Okay. So, what we want to do is we want to put put the egg in. Oops, don't want to do that. Oh, okay. I uh, wasn't thinking. I just ate. I just ate the. Uh, I just ate the egg that I worked so hard to get. Uh, well, oops, wrong button. It's a good thing I have this one still. So. Throw that in there. So what we need to do is we need to turn all of these torches on. And the egg should um, hatch this way. I've seen other people do it this way. You can use uh, torches or you can use... Um, Campfires, anything that uh, anything that produces heat should do it. Um, well, it says it's it says it's incubating, so hopefully hopefully the egg will incubate, um, and hopefully it'll hatch and we'll be able to have our level seventy three oh seventy six level seventy six wavering. Um, it looks like the incubation thing is going down, so perfect. Uh, as soon as it's uh, as soon as it's done, I'll bring you guys back when the egg is about to hatch. Ah, goddamn heat! All right, guys, we're back, and the egg is super, super close to hatching. Um, so I figured I'd bring you guys back just so you guys could see it in the flesh. This is uh, a pretty ma monumentous occasion for me. This is the first. Uh, <gasps> there it is. He hatched. Imprint. Yes, we got him. Um, we'll, we'll name him in a second. But come on, come here, come here, come here. Follow me. Come on out here, buddy. Come on. Just walk outside. All right, now we gotta grab four. Five of these. We'll put these on you. There we go. Let's take a look at this little guy here. Oh, he's so cute. It's just the cutest little thing you've ever seen. Look at his little face. Look at his little dragon face. That's pretty awesome. Um, let's see here, so, he's got about 4,000 health, 800 stamina, oxygen food, nobody really cares, 420 weight, 198 movement speed, oh, 100 movement speed, and 198 uh, melee damage, so he's not bad for a, uh, for a little wyvern, he's pretty good, he's pretty good. Oh, he's so cute. All right, so I'm going to get this guy um, all matured up here. And hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll have a uh, wyvern that we can fly around um, in the episode here. To, to uh, end her off, we'll see if we can't take him up for a flight and get him all, get him a couple levels, um, see what he's made of. And yeah, so... I'm going to be, I'm going to be right back, guys. All right, guys, we're back, and uh, it's been a time between the last cut and this cut. It's actually a whole other day. Um, so I'm going to tell you guys, um, my girlfriend jumped on, and we started playing together, and we got a whole bunch of these little guys all tamed up here. I'm going to actually pick up my little guy. 
and um, did a little bit. We got um, she got an RG, and we've been playing with it. And um, let me show you exactly what's going on here. So we got uh, two dragons now. We got a fire wyvern and a lightning wyvern. Um, our guy here, I named him the. Uh, he's called the Hungarian Horn Tail. And uh, if you guys don't know, that's from Harry Potter. That's a Harry Potter reference. Check. Um, so he's level 119 now. And um, let me show you. His health is at uh, 8,600. Uh, his stamina is at 1,280. Uh, his oxygen food hasn't moved. Uh, his weight is at 551. His melee damage is at 664. And his movement speed is at 105. So he's, uh, he's grown up a little bit. He's pretty good. And um, the Lightning Drake is level 79, and it's at about 5,200 HP, 840 stamina. Oxygen food is null. Uh, his weight is at 420. His melee damage is 282, and his movement speed is 107. So not too, too bad. But uh, So let's get on these guys, and we'll sh play around with them a little bit here. So your basic here, you can walk. Walk around on him on the ground, and he's got a sprint, so you can sprint with him. Um, so his uh, right trigger is his uh, his bite, so you can see here he's got a little chomp. Left trigger is the flamethrower on this guy. Um, the N on the right joystick, the uh, the look around joystick, this one, it's uh, the wing flap, and that will actually push dinos back like so. And if you go up. I think it can gather berries? Nope, it can't gather berries. It is um, a wood thatch cactus. I'm hooked on a rock. Come on, get up here. So we'll go up to this tree here and uh, do the wing flap. Boom, right there. Wooden thatch gathered. Um, I just gotta let me up my gamma here. Okay, um, so when you fly, so basic same thing, he flies, right trigger's bite, left trigger's frame thrower, and in on the joystick is the uh, foot grab, so you can pick up dinos. Um, and if I remember correctly, he can pick up the same dinos that a Quetzal can, so any anything that a, a Quetz can pick up, you can pick up with the dragon. So there's a Morillotops, picked up, done, drop it. Um, He's really he's really powerful. His turning radius is kind of shitty, uh, but they're really fast. Like um, you don't need to up movement speed at all on these things. Like um, Nightwing with his 190 movement speed can't keep up with just the normal flight speed, like this flight speed on the Wyvern. So they're really really fast. So I wouldn't worry about movement speed at all on these things. Um, so I'll land him real quick, and then I'll show you the. Uh, uh, I'll show you very quickly the, um, the Lightning Wyvern. So, Lightning Wyvern has all the same stuff except instead of a uh, flamethrower, he does Lightning Burst. And uh, you can actually aim this and it lasts quite a bit, which is insane to me that you can do that. So, that's, that's kind of what the Lightning Burst does. I'll shoot it right there. See? Pretty cool. Does quite a bit of damage too, um, if you if you got the movement speed upgraded on it. But, but yeah, so that is the that's the wyverns in a nutshell. So if you guys if you guys like the episode and um, you want to come back and watch some more, um, go ahead and hit the like button. Um, if you guys uh, aren't already subscribed, you can go ahead and subscribe too. Um, if you have any comments too, throw those down in the comment section below. If you got any ideas you want me to do, anything you want me to kind of like tame up or anything like that, just uh, leave it in the comments and I'll make a video on it. Um, yeah, um, I want to thank you guys for the support. Uh, every view and like helps us out a bunch. Um, and be sure to come back for more uh, GSL videos. Uh, yeah, join me next time in uh, Ark Scorched Earth. Later.